Wishing the families of Stadros tragedy the best today. I happen to be in Dublin that night as well, and a long, long time waiting for justice. Uh, to honest, I'm questioning the issue of planning exemptions for telecommunication structures such as masts uh, that permit, uh, as per the statutory instrument uh, Class 31 of the Planning and Development Act 2019. There's an exemption that allows for telecommunication masts uh, for companies to erect a mast of 12 metres or less in an area with no notice, uh, confirm, uh, con or no or coordination or indeed warning or public notice for the public or consultation to neighbours or landowners. This is an issue that has arisen in the picturesque village of Cloheen under the V in, 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 in South Tipperary. It has happened in other areas too. A utility work has arrived on site and started preparing the ground uh, to erect this mast. And when locals ask contact my daughter, Councillor Maureen McGrath, and others, are concerned about this. Thankfully, works have since uh, has commenced because it, uh, the fact that in this area is an, is, um, it's in an, uh, an architectural conservation area, you, which is not you. exempt. So companies are running a slip shot here and are taking up masks and Road trying to get away out, and under the, under the radar. So this need to be, exemption needs to be looked at and examined so that people are not uh, trodden on and are not Road, interfered with and have their rights uh, vindicated. So, First of all, I appreciate you raising the issue, Deputy, and I'll talk to the Minister. Did you say, I, I think you, you said that because it was an architectural con area of conservation, uh, that it, it couldn't go ahead? They've stopped. Yeah, which illustrates the importance at times of having areas of conservation to, to stop that kind of behaviour, uh, which would undermine the architectural integrity and heritage of a given town or a given village and so forth. Um, and I'll certainly speak to the Minister in that respect. Deputy.